With so many unanswered questions, yet so much public interest, the legal battle over just how much light should be shed on the search at Mar-a-Lago is heating up. How did the FBI justify raiding Mar-a-Lago and spending nine hours in the president's house? This latest scandal is consuming Republicans and the former president, who is now promising new legal action, a third party, to review what was taken back to Washington. And one of the benefits of the special master, if the master agrees with this, is we can stop DOJ in their tracks when it comes to inspecting these documents. No motion has been filed. And at last Friday's hearing on the release of the search affidavit, a lawyer for Trump did not address the court. Donald Trump seems to be on the wrong end of things uh, legally here. And while the public wants access, so too do politicians. The so-called Gang of Eight, which includes all party and intelligence leaders, have asked for insight. When uh, documents have those markings, it generally indicates that the source of information is very sensitive. For a president rarely bruised by political blows, this time appears no different. A poll of Republican voters shows support for Trump has actually increased in the wake of the search, which could also speed up a potential 2024 announcement that is actually providing optimism for Democrats. Remember, Donald Trump never won the popular vote in either election. So uh, the Democrats, it looks like the, the tide is turning in their direction. With 24 still so far in the future, the focus remains on November's midterms, with Democrats keen to capitalize on recent wins as their opponents grapple with the fate of their future. Reggie Chikini, Global News, Washington.